You're listening to the Monday Night Community Show with Daniel on BRFM. This is the Daniel Monday Night Community Show on demand through YouTube. Thank you very much for choosing to listen to us through this method. If you'd like to keep up to date with when I add new interviews, then subscribe to this channel. So we're now going to be joined on the phone with our regular visitor, uh, Helen. Uh, firstly, as always, thank you very much for joining us. If you could just introduce yourself to our listeners, that'd be great. Hi, my name's Helen and um, I run the Swell Film Society. Um, we have a really active social media presence where we promote local films that are being shown in the area and um, also international film news through our Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. Um, at the Swell Film Society, we're really passionate about encouraging people to go and enjoy good films um, without having to travel too far afield. Um, we also run a film night on the last Friday of every month from the Avenue Theatre in Sittingbourne. Uh, it's a wonderful little venue. Um, it looks like a proper old-fashioned theatre with the red velvet seats and the big red curtains. And also there's a bar there too, if you wish to grab a drink and some snacks before the film. Well, I was going to ask that, actually. How did it go for your um, first time at the Avenue Theatre last month? It was really successful. Um, everyone really enjoyed having um, like the theatre space to like go in and get immersed in the film and having the bar there was really good as well. And, um, yeah, we hope to get more along for February screening. Yeah, I was going to say, it must have felt um, a lot better having the uh, more space and actually being in, you know, what is more or less a proper little cinema. Yeah, that's right. I mean, we really enjoyed our screenings at Ideas Test and it was a great place for us to start off. But um, as you know, we were getting so many people coming along, it was getting quite crowded. So uh, the Avenue Theatre is perfect for us, that people can spread out a bit and, you know, you've got like the proper seats and everything. And yeah, it really sort of adds to that cinema experience. So um, I was wondering if you could next let our listeners know what is your film for this month? Uh, yeah, so our film for February, which is taking place at the Avenue Theatre on Friday the 24th um, of February at 7pm, is the BAFTA winning I, Daniel Blake. Um, it's a Ken Loach film and it stars Dave Johns and Hayley Squires and it's basically a film about the benefit system here in the UK. So uh, how did you come to choose uh, this film? Well, um, well, how do we come to choose it? Well, a lot of people have been talking about it, especially because, you know, um, it's a, it really kind of captures something that's happening in the country right now. Um, the film itself like portrays people who are living and suffering, um, you know, and we kind of felt that it was really sort of like a poignant film for us to show. And um, the fact that we were able to show it even before it comes out on DVD is like, fantastic for us as well. So when we had the opportunity to do that, we thought, right, this is the film we're going to show for February. Was there anything else you'd like to get over or uh, cover to our listeners this month? Um, well, really, just come along and see the film. Um, it really is wonderful. And, um, you know, it's a film that's made a big impact and it's won critical acclaim. Um, most recently, like I said, it won the ba a BAFTA Award and that was for Best British Film. Um, another thing that's rather interesting is that the lead actress, Hayley Squires, is actually a resident of Swale. Um, she comes from Sittingbourne. So, yeah, we're really encouraging people to come along and watch the film and, you know, support a local artist and, you know, see a film that's really good as well. And are there one of the, one of the things that um, you sort of like to promote, perhaps, at, the, um, at what you do, is that it's not just a case people turn up and see the film, is it? You kind of um, talk about it afterwards and uh, introduce it. So it's um, more than just people turning up and seeing a film. Yeah, that's exactly right. Um, we try and make it more of like a social event. So like we encourage people to come along like at seven o'clock when the doors open and, you know, join us in the bar for half an hour before the film starts. And it's, it's a really good way of getting people to like talk about film and to share their experiences and also talk about other film events that are in the area as well. Um, so, yeah, and then we always have a PowerPoint up as well, just kind of like a slideshow, giving you some information about the film. And we also do postcards at each event as well, um, which has just a couple of little bullet points on the back. So you've got something to take away with you. So, you know, you have some information about the film. So it's a great chance to catch up with what's happening in the film world. So if that's something that interests you, you know, by going along, you sort of keep up to date with that as well, it sounds. 
Yeah, that's right. I mean, it is a really good way to kind of, you know, sort of keep your finger on the pulse of what's happening and, yeah, just to find out what's going on. So, Helen, if you could just refresh our listeners uh, when and uh, where our listeners can go along to uh, this month's film. Yeah, so it's on Friday the 24th of February at the Avenue Theatre in Sittingbourne. Um, the doors open at 7 o'clock and the film starts at 7.30 and the film duration is an hour and 40 minutes. Um, please note, <laughs> this film is certified for audiences aged 80, uh, sorry, 15 and over. So if you look like you might be under 15, then please bring your ID. Um, our ticket prices are £4 for non-members and £2 for members. Um, tickets and annual membership can be purchased on the night from the ticket desk. Um, annual membership costs just £5 for the entire year, and that gets you 50% off, the, off your ticket. Um, also, I just wanted to mention that if you'd like to reserve your ticket um, before the screening, then please uh, visit our Facebook page event, which will take you to our event page. Um, and then once you're there, you can register and like reserve your ticket and then just pay for it on the night. It's just that um, we're getting quite booked up already, so we don't want anyone to be disappointed. Helen, as always, thank you very much for joining us. It really is appreciated, and we look forward to catching up with you next month. Yeah, I look forward to speaking to you in March.